towards the end of his his later work and his mature work, we say mature work, um, I think the center of his idea is how do you create a world of atmosphere and light um, and still acknowledge the material that is paint and acknowledge the surface that he's working on. Um, especially in that little piece of coffee, it's a, it's a very soft, kind of warm light. Um, and throughout his career, things change. There's these big jumps from his poured work to his hard work to uh, the kind of figurative, narrative things. But through all of that, there is this, from, as a viewer and painter myself, I can, the way, things I see is that he was focused on these ideas of intensity of atmosphere and light. And you see him working those things out. Um, and when he gets to paintings like it's Cafe Ole, the little coffee painting, you see a, a very f- clear definition of atmosphere and light. Um, he's reduced the hard edges. He's reduced um, the hard materiality. Some of those earlier atmos- real atmospheric paintings are very thickly painted, have a lot of physical uh, work in it. It's like he figured out over time how to reduce it down to, and not reduction in a negative sense, but a clarification of what he was after. Um, of just a very whole world of atmosphere and light so that you could be very intimate and very close to it but at the same time from a distance you acknowledged it as a, a thing and that thing had to be in both worlds.